For millennia, the history of our world lay buried, hidden beneath layers of earth and obscured by the mists of time. It's a humbling thought, isn't it? That beneath our feet lie the stories of countless lives lived and lost, of civilizations that rose and fell long before we took our first breath. But sometimes the earth offers up a clue, a whisper from the past that can change everything. These whispers emerge from the tireless work of dedicated individuals, those who dedicate their lives to brushing back the sands of time, revealing the secrets held captive for generations. Today we explore 10 mind-blowing discoveries in anthropology. These findings have reshaped our understanding of human evolution, culture, and history. From the oldest human fossils to the enigmatic Antikythera mechanism, stay tuned as we reveal the groundbreaking discoveries that have left the world in awe. Our story begins in the Jebel Irhud region of Morocco, a place where the relentless desert winds whisper tales of a time long gone. Here in 1961, amidst the arid landscape, a team of miners stumbled upon something extraordinary, fragments of skulls, jawbones, and flint tools, initially mistaken for remnants of Neanderthals. Further investigation however revealed these remains to be far older than anyone had dared imagine. These were the fossilized remains of early Homo sapiens, our direct ancestors, dating back an astonishing 300,000 years. This discovery you see, completely rewrote the timeline of human evolution, pushing back the origins of our species by a staggering 100,000 years. It painted a new picture of our origins, one that stretched far deeper into prehistory than we had ever conceived. Our journey takes us north now, to the icy plains of Siberia, where another remarkable discovery awaited. Deep within the Denisova cave, nestled in the Altai Mountains, a tiny finger bone, no bigger than a button, emerged from the frozen earth. This unassuming fragment of bone held within it the genetic secrets of an entirely new human species, the Denisovans. Extracting DNA from ancient remains is a delicate and painstaking process, but the results in this case were nothing short of revolutionary. The Denisovans, the analysis revealed, were a distinct lineage of humans genetically different from both Neanderthals and Homo sapiens, yet sharing a common ancestor with both. Imagine a human species coexisting alongside our own ancestors, their existence only revealed through the tiniest whisper of genetic material. From the frozen north, we shift our focus south to the sun-drenched plains of southeastern Turkey. Here, rising from a landscape that time forgot, lie the ruins of Gobekli Tepe, a site that has challenged our very understanding of civilization. Imagine, if you will, a time before pottery, before the wheel, even before agriculture, a time when humans were just beginning to experiment with the domestication of plants and animals. It was during this epoch over 11,000 years ago that the people of Gobekli Tepe constructed something truly extraordinary. They erected massive stone pillars, some towering over 16 feet tall and adorned with intricate carvings of animals, both real and imagined. These weren't merely crude markings, these were the work of skilled artisans, people who had mastered the art of stone carving millennia, before we thought possible. Our next chapter takes us to the Indonesian island of Flores, a land shrouded in mist and legend, where in 2003, a team of researchers made a discovery that seemed straight out of the pages of a fantasy novel. Deep within the Liangbua cave, they unearthed the skeletal remains of a human species, unlike anything they had ever encountered. This wasn't a case of simply finding a smaller version of ourselves. These individuals, nicknamed hobbits, due to their diminutive stature, possessed a unique combination of primitive and advanced features that set them apart from any other human species. Standing just over three feet tall with a brain size comparable to a chimpanzee, Homo floresiensis, as they were scientifically named, challenged our preconceived notions of human evolution, demonstrating that our genus was far more diverse than we had ever imagined. These weren't just small humans, they were a distinct branch of our family tree, adapted to the unique environment of their island home. Our understanding of the past is often limited by the physical remains left behind, but what if we could reach back through time and unlock the secrets held within the very building blocks of life itself? 
This isn't science fiction, this is the reality of ancient DNA analysis, a revolutionary tool that has transformed the field of anthropology, allowing us to trace the threads of human history with unprecedented precision. Imagine being able to extract DNA from bones thousands, even tens of thousands of years old, and piece together the genetic history of our species. We can track ancient migrations, unravel the mysteries of human evolution, and even gain insights into the health and diseases of our ancestors all through the power of ancient DNA. Imagine walking in the footsteps of your ancestors tracing the very paths they took millions of years ago. In Tanzania's Laetoli region this isn't a flight of fancy, it's a tangible link to our distant past. Here, preserved in volcanic ash lie a series of footprints, a poignant testament to a pivotal moment in human evolution, the dawn of bipedalism. These footprints dating back 3.6 million years weren't made by modern humans but by our early ancestors Australopithecus afarensis, the same species as the famed Lucy skeleton. What makes these footprints so remarkable is that they capture a fleeting moment frozen in time, a snapshot of our ancestors walking upright, their strides remarkably similar to our own. Whispers Across the Bering Land Bridge For generations the story of human migration to the Americas remained shrouded in mystery, a puzzle with missing pieces. Then, in 1926, near Folsom, New Mexico, a discovery was made that would forever change our understanding of the first Americans. It was a simple spear point, crafted from a material not found naturally in the area, but its significance was monumental. The spear point, found lodged between the ribs of an extinct species of bison, provided irrefutable evidence that humans had arrived in North America thousands of years earlier than previously thought. This spear point and the artifacts that followed, collectively known as Clovis points, painted a picture of a people who were masters of their environment, skilled hunters who had adapted to the challenges of life in Ice Age North America. A message from the ice. High in the Italian Alps, nestled amidst the icy peaks, a time capsule lay frozen for millennia, its secrets locked away until a fateful day in 1991. It wasn't a chest of gold or a lost city that emerged from the melting ice but something far more extraordinary, the mummified remains of a man who had lived and died over 5,300 years ago. Otzi the Iceman as he came to be known, wasn't just a skeleton, he was a snapshot of life in the Copper Age, his body and possessions remarkably preserved by the ice. From the clothes on his back to the tools at his side, Otzi offered an unprecedented glimpse into the daily life of our ancient ancestors. The Birth of Art In the heart of France, concealed within a limestone ridge, lies a cave that holds not gold or jewels, but treasures far more precious, the earliest known masterpieces of human art. Discovered by accident in 1940 by four teenagers exploring the French countryside, the Lascaux cave paintings transport us back in time to a world where animals roamed free and humans sought refuge in the Earth's embrace. Imagine the flicker of torches illuminating the cave walls, casting dancing shadows on the vibrant murals that adorned them. Horses, aurochs, deer, and other creatures spring to life in a riot of color and movement, their forms rendered with astonishing skill and artistry. These weren't mere doodles, these were deliberate creations imbued with meaning and purpose, expressions of creativity that transcended the boundaries of language and time. A clockwork universe. Our final journey takes us beneath the waves, to the depths of the Aegean Sea where, in 1901, sponge divers made a discovery that would challenge our understanding of ancient technology. It wasn't a sunken city or a hoard of treasure they found, but a corroded lump of bronze, its gears and inscriptions hinting at a complexity far beyond anything they could have imagined. This, my friends, was the Antikythera mechanism, an astronomical calculator of astonishing sophistication, its intricate workings predating any known device of comparable complexity by over a millennium. Imagine the minds that conceived of such a device over 2,000 years ago, their understanding of astronomy and mechanics so advanced that they could build a machine to track the movements of the heavens with remarkable accuracy. Outro, a journey through time. From the sun-baked deserts of Morocco to the icy plains of Siberia, from the depths of the ocean to the depths of time itself, 
We've journeyed together exploring remarkable discoveries that reshape our understanding of human history. These discoveries remind us that the past is a vast, ever-unfolding tapestry. Each artifact whispers to us across the millennia, urging us to listen and learn. If you enjoyed this journey, subscribe to Herox Productions for more fascinating content. Check out our other videos for more insights into anthropology. Thank you for watching. Until next time, this